Hey guys, today I'm working on a 2003 Buick LeSabre. This one, a uh, customer's complaint is the traction light, ABS light, brake light comes on intermittently. So, uh, this is a, quite a common issue with these EBCM modules. They fail inside. You gotta reflow the relay and a few other areas on the circuit board. So, to confirm that, we're going to go into the ABS module here, just confirm the fault codes that we have in here, C1214, their system relay contacts circuit is open, so it's usually just a bad solder joint, the bulk of repairing this thing is just reopening it and then resealing it back up, uh, the repair is actually quite easy, but otherwise let's... Uh, let me show you where the module is located. All right, so the module is located directly under the air box right there, bolted to the ABS pump. So it looks like there's like T25 Torx screws, uh, four of them, and uh, one connector. So we can either just get it here from the top or remove that uh, fender liner, but I think I'm just gonna get it from the top. It's probably not worth removing that fender liner to get to it. So yeah, I'm gonna get this thing off and get it repaired. All right, so we got it open. And as you can see, right there, See the bad solder joints here, here, here. So we're just going to go through, reflow all of that, and then we'll touch up pretty much all the joints. That one's pretty dry. That one's bad. Now this is the main issue right here. That's what would cause that fault code. So we're going to go through it and put it back together. Reseal it. Reseal this with some gasket maker. Just bolt it back together. Alright, there it is all cleaned up. Nice shiny solder joints. If you can't get it to flow like this, you're probably using not enough heat. And I'm gonna just, I'm gonna apply gasket maker along this perimeter and then reseal it properly. Make sure there's enough and then get it put back in the car. Alright, I got the gasket maker all over the perimeter. Made sure that every square inch is covered. Just carefully lower it in. Gonna ooze out the sides, which is good. I cleaned up the extra gasket maker. It's ready to be put back in. All right, guys, I got the unit back in the car.
Let's see if there's any fault codes. Should be just the history codes, which I should be able to clear out because the other ones wouldn't go away when I would erase either. It says history. That wraps it up for this one. If you have this issue on your vehicle, you could send us the ABS module for repair. I'll have a link to our website in the description of this video. Thanks for watching.